Hi there, this is Damien from Pet Business Blueprint and in this video we are going to take a look at uh, how to put your brochure on your website for download. So you see this little widget here in the sidebar. Um, so you can put anything you want there for them to download. It can be several documents, it can be a single document, but in this example I'm just going to show you the basics on how to do it. So what we do is we go to um, the home page of the website and in the browser bar we do wp-admin takes us to the login section of our website put our username and password in here log into the site and first thing we want to do is we want to add the file to our media folder on the website so we click on media and we go add new and then we can just drag and drop the file into this box here. So I've got the file here, I've already edited it, I've edited the template for my price list. I've got it here, it's just a rough demo. And I'm going to drag the PDF, so it's good to, even if you're doing it in Word, whatever program you're doing it in, make sure you save your brochure or your price list in PDF format. Just a lot neater, it's nice and compact. and. Um, they won't have any trouble opening it, so um, unless unlike, unlike a Word document or something like that, which they um, they could have trouble opening. So it's even in Word or whatever program you're using, you can just go save as PDF. So then find your PDF file on your hard drive, drag and drop it here, and it's adding it to your website now. then once it's finished, it's just processing it, um, actually I might finish processing it, once it's done you click on edit and what we want to do is copy the file URL from here, so double, triple click that, go control C, copy and paste and now we've got that link in, it in the clipboard, so now we go to appearance, widgets, because that's what it is in the sidebar, it's a widget we find that along this right hand side here, and it's this peekaboo download and our brochure with prices so we can change that to any wording we want, so we can say our price list we can write, you know, our s service prices, whatever you want and then you just paste the link that we just copied into that box there and then you save that now there might be several instances of this um, little brochure thing throughout the site, so you just want to make sure. So yeah, so on your home page, so that's just your primary sidebar for the internal pages. Your home page sidebar has a different um, instance of that widget, so we have to do the same thing on the home page sidebar. Paste it there, go save, and then that should be the only places it's on the site. Unless you want to put that, you can add that to any area on the site that you. So you can add little columns on the um, at the bottom of the home page if you want, um, and see our section on customizing the columns and the sidebars about how to do that. So now that we've added it, we're on the home page. If we click this now, it goes straight to um, it opens this in their browser, and they can now save it. So they can save it to their half hard drive. But at any rate, it just opens up the, um, the whole price list for them. And same thing if we're on the internal pages. Download our price list. Same thing. Opens it in their browser. And... Yep, they can just save it from there. Or print it. So that is how you add your... Um, that's how you add your brochures for download on your website. Okay, thanks.